Morning guys, so spring is uh, well and truly here, got some awesome weather, sun's out, I think it's supposed to be like, the news said it's going to be like 17 degrees or something, but it's actually only like 14 or something, but still, 14 in England is basically summer, so I thought I'd get out Pack on, just going up to my little spot where me and my son have started to build a bit of a bit of a shelter, uh, the den as he calls it. So I'm going to get there, make see if it's uh, see if it's still up, and if it is, I shall carry on, add a few extra bits to it. Um, I'm on my own today, I haven't got haven't got the boy with me, but. I think me if the weather's kind with tomorrow me and him may take a walk up so I may do another video with me and him at the shelter but um yeah just a nice little trip out really look at that and this wood behind me this is sort of um I think it's public land but I don't really care to be honest it's literally on my doorstep my house is just the other side of this and I'm just walking up the public footpath where all the dog walkers go so uh, so yeah I'll bring you back when we get to the shelter cheers guys Okay, so here's the beginnings of me and the boys' shelter. Um, these supports, I want to change that for a, a Y. I want to change that for a Y as well, just for a bit more structural support. But uh, yeah, that's it really. That's the side wall. Needs a lot more work, obviously. Um, last time we come here, I didn't actually have a saw with me, so. He's only cutting off. But, uh, Ramsons are growing already. And the last shelter I built in a video a long time ago was just down there. And uh, yeah, that one wasn't great to be honest, it was a bit small, so, so I decided to rebuild in this location. So, I shall bring you back in a bit. What I've done, we've got a bit of wind coming from that direction, it's not a lot, but also this is a sort of a dog walker's path, so I'm gonna, I've got a lavu half with me, so I'm going to stick it up just as a somewhere to sit, and uh also got a new chair, which is that blue thing. I'm gonna to have to make a a green bag for it. But yeah, that was a birthday present from my girlfriend. It's uh, actually a copy of the Helenox one, but uh, it's brilliant. I'm really chuffed with it, and I shall I shall show you that once I get it set up. So yeah, I'm gonna put this lavu off up and then do a bit of work on the shelter. Cheers, guys.
You've never used a wood gas stove before. This is how you fill it. Fill it with your fuel first. Then you light it from the top. It's also known as the Wazza method. The world's most knowledgeable carp fisherman. Right there. Cheers. And while that's still up, uh, let's get this for lunch. This is out of one of the French uh, ration packs. I think it's salmon and rice, I think. Pop the lid a little bit. Chuck it straight on there to warm up. The only issue I'm having with the chair so far is the same issue that anyone with the this style chair, I think OEX do one as well. Is that these I haven't got much of a footprint so as soon as you put them on soft ground like this in the woods they sink so I've seen it suggested that you put a uh, half tennis ball over the end so that's what I shall be um, carrying with me from now on some tennis balls <laughs> So, as per usual, I've forgotten to bring cutlery. I always do it, don't know why. So, makeshift spoon that just knocks up. <laughs> Let's have a look. Amazing. Right. I'm going to eat this and uh, I may bring you back for packing down. Um, I'm going to head back soon for about 3 o'clock I think so. Thanks for joining us and um, we'll see you again soon. Cheers guys. Okay so 
I found an old basket at a, I think it was a homeless camp. Uh, I'll show it in one of my other videos anyway. Uh, yeah, I found a basket there, which I thought would be good for, to use as a grill over the fire. Um, but what I've done, as you can see in there or not, that's a load of dry kindling. And I've just chucked a load of bark off a rotten tree over the top of it. So I've got a little dry sort of kindling store there. Right then guys, once again, thanks for watching and uh, we'll see you soon.